Last night, you could see flames from this vantage point, but tonight it is very dark out there. So either the fire has pushed down into the canyon or the smoke is just too thick to see anything. Now, for folks this morning told to grab their stuff and get out, they're hoping this is a sign of progress. Right now, about 60 people are staying at the Red Cross shelter. That's at the Bradshaw Mountain High School in Prescott Valley. Volunteers tell me the numbers have been changing. Some people come in and going, especially with the new evacuations this morning. Now, for some people, if this shelter wasn't here, they'd have no other place to go. Jay and Alex Gardner had to get out of Blue Hills this morning. They found a place for their pets, but they are now waiting things out at the shelter. We packed whatever we could, put it in the van and, and left. I mean, all the important stuff, but when you look around, it's all important. It's your whole life in there. You know, what do you take? Yeah, what do you leave? You don't have time to get a U-Haul and go pack everything, so you just have to take pictures and yep. whatever is important to oh. you. We're expected to get an update from fire officials tomorrow morning to see what kind of progress they had made on the fire. Reporting in Dewey, Carissa Planalp, CBS 5 News.